Howdy cowdies. G'day. Welcome to another little weekly walk about the collector. Got heaps of cool stuff to hock this week. Nice little twin set there of Conway Stewart Penn, some old Fitzroy Footy Club membership tickets. Might be sort of mesh or chain mail little purse. Lovely little Art Deco box there. Some really nice little bits of jewellery. Little bar brooch is cute. Little 14 karat gold propelling pencil. He's really nice little sort of eyepiece there. Really cute little fold up uh, knife in the little plastic bag. A little cardboard domino set which I can't recall seeing before. A cardboard set. He's cute little compact there. Celluloid compact early plastic. Some really nice stuff in the jewellery cabinet this week guys. Little photographs there of um, natives. Cool old sort of sew on footy club badges. Some nice bits of silver. Pistol club sew on badges. Footy cards. Really cool pair of old sunglasses over the back there from the 1920s. A lot of sewing patches, mobile gas, ampole and other stuff in amongst. Lots of nice little bits in the jewellery cabinet this week. What else we got? This is a really cool little 1930s sort of Art Deco little shelving unit there. A little sort of drum, rounded drum supports. He's cute, the little oak desk. A little sort of drop side on it. little stool there goes with it. Lovely old milk canister there with the sort of old copper plaque on it. Pretty cool little office chair as well. Nice Chevelle mirror. And a little sort of filing tool drawer, whatever you want to call it. Little metal industrial things, pretty cute. A couple of Franco Cozzo style little stands. <laughs> pretty cool little retro cabinet and some other sort of industrial shelving bits and bobs. And we've got boxes of CDs, mixed boxes of stuff, tools and blokey gear, fishing tackle and fishing rods. A nice old little wooden camphor wood trunk there. And he's pretty cool, this big trunk on wheels. Nice little Yamaha stereo amp receiver. Big lot of picture frames and prints and stuff. These are pretty cool. A pair of the old 12 slotter mags. I don't see them around that much anymore, the old 12 slotters. A couple of nice little prints there. A little religious chromo lithograph with the convex glass. Some lovely old books and stuff as well. And heaps of stamps this week and footy records. It's a pretty cool old esky. Sort of double sided. And this one's a ripper, the Rota Picnic Freezer. It's in sh fantastic condition. Really cool thing. There you go. The bird with the bobbing head. Nice big green glass bottle. Not easy being green. And this is really nice set, this. Big lot of sort of hand wrought, blacksmith, wrought iron, sort of fire tidy sets. Or, you know, torture tools or something like that. They've all got little stamps on them saying M. Sheedy. There we go. It's hard to see there. But really cool lot. M&M dispensers, little snare drum, some old kids toys, little bendy footy mascots there from the not probably late 80s, something like that. Some little rugs and materials and things, big box cutlery set. This is pretty cool with Charles Reddington, abstract screen print. Great plan, an American chap that came out here in the 1960s and brought the sort of abstract expressionist movement with him out here and was painting a lot and influencing a lot of our painters. It's a really nice thing. He's a bit obscure. You don't see much of his stuff, but that's a cracker of a bit. Really like it. Got some other nice things here. A couple of nice little pairs of chromo lithographs in their gilt frames. This is lovely. The old sort of 19th century European school oil there. Of Christ. Receiving a bit of coinage or something. And a lovely old photograph there of the gardens in Paris. Really nicely presented. Original frame and mount and everything. Some nice pickies this week. Yeah, what else have we got, huh? Got some bottles of Plonk as well. Johnny Walker Black Label down the bottom. Nice old bottle stand, actually. Bottle of Glenfiddich there. Nice single malt whiskey. Good stuff. Bottle of Cognac, the Cavorsier Cognac. It's an old Geiger counter. Pretty cool. Some old footy records. Got no idea what that thing is. But it looks pretty cool. <laughs> Little riding crop, which will be good fun late on a Friday night. Oh, early on a Saturday morning. Cool little mint box cars and some signed Fitzroy Football Club player signatures and stuff like that from the 1980s. There you go. He's a nice old Buddy L truck up the top there. He's seen better days. Bushels tin's cool. Big John Bowles Falcon Caterpillar racer. Some footy records again. Some finals ones. Nice big lot of badges. All um, 
Australian and other airline badges. Pretty cool lot. Some boxed uh, racing cars again and the big sort of Falcon GDHO. More Fitzroy Footy Club stuff. There you go. Heaps of cool stuff this week. Big bag of Fitzroy badges. Nice big lot of China. There you go. Some bow and some arrows and some tribal stuff. Nice big West German vase. Uh, first day covers. More pilot badges. It's actually a nice little wave vase over the back there. Quite unusual. Nice bits of pressed glass. Little mantle radios. Cute. Scrap albums are quite interesting. All Australian scrap albums. World War II period. Mainly featuring the RAAF. Fishing rods, more Fitzroy stuff, a couple of mint box Kenworth trucks. Uh, There's a little album there of all rugby league cards, even though it says football on the cover. It's rugby. <laughs> nice lot of camera gear in that case. Nice big lot of blue and white china. Lovely big lot. Postcards, these are pretty cool. Tower brand polish made in Malden. More good Australian stamps, mainly pre-decimal stuff. Pretty cool little Hona Melodica. Some nice little sort of crafty implements. Victorian China. It's a cool book. Sydney and Melbourne race courses. The old brass spit. Clockwork spit turner thing. Oh, some interesting little bits and bobs this week, guys. Jesus. Nice little glass oil lamp, actually. The green glass base on it. And we've got some nice things in the end cabinet. The big embossing press there. Little New Zealand naval stuff, little pennant there, I think dated 1945 for HMS Indefatigable. Try saying that 16 times quickly. Little green C Mac uh, Mixmaster, pretty cool. Here's a great little sort of steam engine, a little aeroplane motor there as well. The bronze, African bronze, elongated figures are quite unusual, got a bit of age to them. Beautiful old, what is it, horoscope or something like that, the badges uh, come off it. Lovely old projector there. Put photographs in the back. And cool little lot. Little pamphlet there. RAAF Point Cook. Grand final record from 67 in great condition. Lovely old ice crusher. These are really nice. The pair of Tunstall. They're upside down. They're Victorian sort of hanging planters. Some sort of Clarice Cliff style stuff. Victorian bird cages a ripper. You get the bonus stuffed uh, kookaburra in there. Some sterling silver hand mirrors. All hallmarked. Got lots of nice stuff this week, guys. Some nice bits of glass. Kind of like this fluorite glass. See the colour of it there? It's kind of pretty blue, isn't it? You take it out and put it under normal light. Oh, it's hard to see now, but it's purple. It changes colour, different light. Cool stuff. Nice big Diana Waltzing Matilda musical jug. Nice bit of poker work. This stuff gets overlooked a bit. Never sells for much, and it should. Lovely big bushels tin in Great Nick. Really like this photograph. Little kid in sort of fancy dress elf or fairy costume there, about 1910. Really cool thing. Nice little bit of Wedgwood there, little sort of 19th century piece. A couple of lovely bits of glass. Murano, and this one signed Australian, signed JR, dated 1991. St Kilda Grand Final record 1966. If you're a fan, you probably should have a crack at it. They'll never win another one. <laughs> Reg Preston vase is cute with the typical sort of ten moco glaze. Lovely big Moran and Kato tea tin as well. I like that little Italian glass vessel also is a nice little bit. And this toaster, never seen one in there before with the actual sort of porcelain sides on it. Drop sides, Bakelite, porcelain, the rest. Really cool thing. Anyway, hopefully you saw something you liked this week. You probably didn't. Shit happens. Yeah.